Hi guys! Okay, so today we're going to do a video that um, is kind of new. It's just, um, I'm going to do kind of my makeup collection at camp in three different kind of videos because I have them in three different kind of storage area things. So the first one I'm going to do is kind of a surprise because I have this makeup bag from Benefit and I really haven't opened it. So I've brought the makeup but I really haven't used it. So I kind of want to see what's in here but I kind of want to do it on surprise on camera. So we're going to get started. I'm just going to reach in and put a product and see what I brought. So the first thing is my Buxom lip gloss and I believe it's OMG and it's just a really pretty um, pretty dark purple lip gloss. So I'm excited that that's here and I have to try and remember to use it. The next thing is a Model Co lip gloss in the shade Striptease. So it's just a nude one. So that's exciting as well. It's kind of sticky, so I should probably keep that a little bit better stored. Something might have leaked, <laughs> unfortunately. The next is a L'Oreal lipstick in Peach Fuzz. You can't. So this is the color. It's kind of a nice pink nudist color. So that's exciting. I'm finding all these lip products, which is awesome. Next is a CoverGirl lipstick in Hot Passion. And it is just a red, a nice red lipstick. I have a lot of reds because I like that look, that vintage look. Next is my Flower Balm Victor and Rolf Roller Ball. So that's exciting. Try a new scent. Next is the Maybelline The Rocket Volume Express Mascara. Another mascara to use. Next is the Ico Skinny Liquid Eyeliner in Black. Ico Blended. So that's awesome. I actually haven't done a lot of eyelining, but I actually do really like this one. It's got a nice tip on it. Next is my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. Now that it's getting out of summer, I might be able to use bronzer to lighten up my face in the fall, to tan up my face in the fall. Next is the Monster Gloss Super Shine Lip Gloss, and I don't know what shade it's in. Angel Kisses. So it's just a nice over-the-top gloss. Next is a Maybelline Eye Studio Liquid uh, Gel Eyeliner in Blackest Black. So I'll just try that. Next is a Urban Decay Eyeshadow in the color Woodstock. Just a nice pink. I actually really like the packaging on these. They're just really cute and kind of um, industrial, but they're really cute as well. Next is a Revlon Lip Butter in the color Creme Brulee. So just a nice nude lip butter. Next is a lip liner from CoverGirl in the color Passion. So that'll go well with my red lipsticks. If I do red lips, I really don't try to do dramatic um, makeup for work just because it is a warehouse, but Makeup Forever Professional High Definition Powder for setting. So that'll be nice to have. Um, new Maybelline Vivids in Fuchsia Flash. So that's just a very bright pink, which is awesome. Next is a MAC lipstick in the color Rebel, which is just nice and dark. So that'll be fun to play with. I usually use that with the Buxom. Next is my Mary Luminizer Highlighter, which I would show you. The pan's kind of falling out, I've noticed. So. That's that. A Luxe Box powder brush, so I can use that with my may, um, Makeup Forever Setting Lip Powder. NARS bronzer, I mean blush, in Outlaw. So that's it. I always like this blush for fall because it's kind of darker than Orgasm. And NARS Orgasm. So there's another bra blush. Can't believe I've been hiding these products from myself. That's not very nice. And then a Smashbox. Lip Enhancing Gloss in the color Razzle. So just a nice berry color. Next is the Maybelline Age Rewind Dark Circles Concealer. And I need one because I actually, I think, left my Olay one in a hotel, which I was really sad about. And then there's a OCC Lip Tar in the color NSFW. So just a nice red. I love those. Those are very potent pro the products. Next is a MAC uh, Technical Liner in Graph Black, so it's just a black pencil. Get to the bottom, 
Next is a Revlon Color Stay Smoky Shadow Stick in Torch. Next is a Too Faced Shadow Insurance Sample. Is that it? Oh, and then there's a a little, oh, oh right, the Maybelline Gel Eyeliner Brush. So I'll just put that in my brushes. So that was the first of three of my camp makeup collection. Comment below your favorite product out of the products that I've shown, and I will be filming part two and part three in the next couple of days. So look forward to those. Okay, bye.